Hi guys, welcome to Shields Cooking. Today we're going to make the most amazing sticky pumpkin beignets. They're going to be filled with sweet and sour pumpkin and the glaze we're going to make from different spices with carrot juice and honey. So, let's begin. Start by cutting two butternut squashes in half. Now use a spoon to scrape out the seeds. Keep the seeds aside for later. Then cut a cross pattern into two halves. After that, drizzle some olive oil on top and season with some flaky salt. Now fill the holes with a couple of leaves of sage and turn them around on a silicon sheet. Bake them at 180 degrees Celsius for one hour. Once they're cooked, turn them around and scrape out the meat. Put 150 grams of the meat into a bowl together with 180 grams of carrot juice, 2 eggs and 6 grams of salt. Now mix this with a hand blender until it's smooth. Then add 240 grams of flour and 30 grams of cornstarch. Mix this until it's smooth once more and once it's smooth directly stop with mixing. You don't want to activate too much gluten. Then pour it into a siphon and charge it with two charges. Be sure to shake it well after each charge and then let it rest overnight in your fridge. Now the squash filling. Take your remaining halves and clean the sides. Then cut them on a mandolin into some thin slices. After that cut those slices into julienne and then into small cubes called brunoise. Set this aside for later. Now pour 130 grams of white wine into a saucepan and also add 130 grams of water, 130 grams of white wine vinegar, 130 grams of sugar and 4 grams of salt. Then chop one lemongrass into small pieces and do this as well with 40 grams of ginger. Add this to the saucepan together with 5 pieces of lime leaf. Bring this to a boil. Once it's boiling, turn off the heat and let it marinate for 2 hours. Then bring it to a boil once more and put it through a sieve onto the cut squash. Now cover it and let it marinate in your fridge for at least 4 hours. After that, drain it. Then the toasted mustard seeds. Transfer 200 grams of whole grain mustard into a saucepan together with 200 grams of neutral oil. Now let this simmer on a low heat until the seeds are caramelized. Stir it every now and then to prevent it from burning. Once it's caramelized, put it through a sieve and then transfer it onto some kitchen paper to extract as many oil as possible. Once it has cooled down, keep it dry and covered. Then the glaze. Pour 600 grams of carrot juice into a saucepan and also add 100 grams of honey and 2 grams of salt. Now chop one lemongrass into small pieces and do this as well with 20 grams of ginger. Add this to the saucepan together with 5 lime leaves. Reduce this on a low heat till one third. Then put it through a fine sieve. Now the squash seeds. Transfer them into some hot water and clean them. After that, let them dry on the kitchen paper. Now spread them onto a silicon sheet and drizzle some olive oil and flaky salt on top. Then toast them for 20 minutes at 160 degrees Celsius. Now heat up a pan filled with oil till it's 180 degrees Celsius and put the ladle in the oil as well and when it's hot fill it halfway with the batter. Then put a spoon of the filling on top and cover this with some more batter. Now carefully lower the ladle into the fat and then the beignets should let go of the ladle. 
Now baste it with the oil until it's golden brown on all sides. After that, bring some glaze to a boil and once it's boiling, add the beignets and cover them with the sticky glaze. And sprinkle some of the caramelized mustard seeds and squash seeds on top. And now, they're ready to be served. Crunchy and sticky on the outside and fluffy on the inside. Just beautiful. Okay guys, that's it for today. I hope you've enjoyed the video. So please let me know in the comments on what you want to see next. Like and share the video and subscribe if you want to support my channel and see more amazing cooking videos. I hope you're having a wonderful day and as always, bon appetit!